Arkansas is one of the most gun-friendly states in the country, and a proposed law would keep it that way. A recently filed bill would let Arkansans have more control of which gun regulations it would abide by. Our Jay Burr has more on what a Second Amendment sanctuary state would mean. I'm going to give that two thumbs up because uh, I think it's awesome. I think we need that in the state. We like our guns here in Arkansas. Josh Gwynn sells guns and ammo and believes that Arkansas needs to stand up against any potential overreach by the federal government. What I hope is is that it's just going to send a message to a democratically ran Senate right now and House that we're not just going to roll over and go, okay, yeah, right, take away these rights. We're going to be cool with that because that's not, that's not how it's going to work. Kelly Crowd is a gun owner and thinks much of the hype around gun regulations originates from this past election cycle. I think it's a knee-jerk reaction to some Democrats uh, making some offices that maybe people didn't want them to make. I think people tend to get very stressed out about their gun rights and responsible gun owners don't need to be worried. She thinks Arkansas should not try to send a message by ignoring federal mandates, especially when it could cost taxpayer dollars. That it'll end up in court and it's just going to waste Arkansas taxpayer money when we could actually just obey the federal law. Instead of legislation like this, Kraut would like to see the General Assembly tackle what she calls common sense gun regulation. I'd really love to see Arkansas focus more on doing things like trying to keep guns out of the hands of domestic abusers rather than just try to make it easier for everybody to get a gun who wants one. Gwen thinks this bill would send a message, but shouldn't have to because the Constitution already spells it out. I think the Second Amendment is very clear, and there should be no reason to create a stance. The stance has already been made. We did reach out to Attorney General Leslie Rutledge on the legality of this bill today, and she sent a statement to Fox 16 saying, and I quote, I have long been a strong proponent of the Second Amendment, and I will always work to strengthen our gun rights. I will be continuously watchful of federal overreach by the Biden administration on gun regulation. Of course, we here at Fox 16 will keep track of this bill and update.